I'm here at HPE Discover in Las Vegas with Doug Coe, and part of the Nimble acquisition was the Cloud Volumes product that, that came in, um, but that, I think that was roughly a year ago. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about how that's evolved over the last year? Sure, yeah. So yeah, absolutely, I came in from Nimble Storage, and one of the you know, key parts of our portfolio, especially around the cloud, was Nimble Cloud Volumes. We, we have now expanded it, and now it's called HPE Cloud Volumes, and it really addresses the need for customers to run enterprise applications in the cloud. So it really provides an enterprise-grade cloud storage service for running things like SAP, Oracle, SQL Server, as well as enabling our customers to easily move data from their arrays directly to the cloud. So what, is, what does that mean, like a, a cloud volume? Because I mean, you think about like AWS has its own storage model, mm -hmm. Azure has their own storage model. So what, what makes this different? Yeah, so what really makes a difference is we're d delivering an enterprise grade service. So we're really kind of kicking up the notch both the reliability, durability, as well as some of the enterprise feature sets like snapshots, cloning, and you know, enterprise scale, so running a lot more size in terms of capacity as well as I.O. that you can run on those volumes. And I, I know you mentioned a couple of specific use cases, but like, what are, what are customers typically uh, doing with cloud volumes? Yeah, so one of the key things that you know, coming into HPE is really looking to expand to make their entire storage portfolio cloud ready. So what we enable a lot of customers to do is really enable their on-premises storage to easily move the data to the cloud. So one of the big use cases is just replicating data and having a DR site or a backup copy in the cloud. So we're able to do this with both cloud volumes as well as a new offering we have out with HP, which is HP Cloud Bank Storage, which works with our 3PAR and our StoreOne's backup appliances, so all flash and, and backup. So that's a big use case. Uh, the other use case that you know, we see with cloud volumes is because we're able to drive the same level of all flash performance in the cloud, you, know, you could run high performance analytics or test dev. Uh, and even the way we do cloning and snapshots, they're able to basically do cloud bursting, make a lot of copies of the data readily available very quickly at a very cost effective manner. And so, in a scenario where you, you're doing like that high performance mm -hmm. uh, work in the cloud, do you have to have a on-premise version as well, or is it, it going to be? Could you do a purely cloud play? Yeah. So, what's cool about cloud volumes is it does have both a cloud native option as well as a hybrid option. So, most of our customers, because you know we came from Nimble and HP, were. Uh, on-premises uh, hardware company, most of them are doing the hybrid, but we definitely have an option for cloud native as well too, so you could deploy cloud native volume and just run it in a cloud without, without the need to move it back and forth. Got it. All right, thanks, Doug. All right, thank you.